Korean Celeb Besties IRL Korean celebs are just like you and I, in the sense that they also long for good friends who they can let loose with and just be their normal selves around. What's even better is when those friends turn out to be celebrities, as it allows them to understand all the rigors and stresses that are associated within their work and industry. And it might affect our actors on a day-to-day -day basis. Today, we're showcasing some famous celebs who are the best of friends. Lee Jung Jae and Jung Woo Sung Having met in the late 90s while filming a movie, these two buds later went on to become business partners by forming their very own talent agency. In part to a strong bond of friendship and a mutual interest in the entertainment industry. You're probably recognizing Lee Jung Jae from his previous works, including the worldwide popular K-drama Squid Game. Jung Woo Sung has had some supporting and main roles and also director credits to his name. He's multi-talented. His next work will be in the upcoming K-drama Say You Love Me, starring on camera in a main role. While Lee Jung Jae's next role has him back in Squid Game Season 2 to face off against the bad guys. If you're curious about their work together, 2022's Hunt has Lee Jung Jae's directorial debut while also casting bestie Jung Woo Sung in a lead role. Now what could be better than making movie magic with your bestie? The film is an action mystery spy movie. Lee Min Ho and Jung Il Woo these two celebs met as teens through mutual contacts and became friends. Did you know that they also share one of the longest-running celeb friendships in the Korean entertainment industry? Jung Il Woo debuted in 2006, where Lee Min Ho already had garnered guest role appearances in 2002. Both also played Flower Boys. Jung Il Woo in Flower Boy Ramen Shop and Lee Min Ho in Boys Over Flowers. The actors share many common preferences when they hang out for meals or drinks. Jung Il Woo knew of Lee Min Ho before they met, as Min Ho was popular and known around his school for his good looks. We wish these two friends more good adventures together. Did you know as of this video, they are both exactly in their mid-30s. Song Kang and An Hyo Seop These two famous celebs seem to share a strong connection of support and friendship for each other, even if they're not hanging out or in the public's view. Netizens seem to have uncovered a charming comments chat where the two shared positive greetings and a cheerful mention to meet up soon. But fans might also be curious for more info on how exactly they know each other. It seems a little mysterious, but that's okay. Seeing the two stars share the support for one another, like at a 2021 award ceremony, which made fans of the celebrities even more curious, but also cheer for their friendship. As you know, some friendships could even be in the way of pen pals until an opportunity to meet arises. Park Shin Hye and Lee Hong Ki, going way back to a 2009 K drama, You Are Beautiful, where they co starred together. Park Shin Hye and Lee Hong Ki have been close friends for years. It should be noted that Park Shin Hye appears to have many dearest and close friends. But today we're giving spotlight to this friendship. She and Lee Hong Ki have shared many life milestone moments together. While even at her beautiful wedding to Che Tae Jun, her bestie was not only in attendance, but also took the stage to sing the main song from the Airs K drama. <laughs> The song titled, I'm Saying, which at the wedding touched everyone's hearts. To revisit such a memorable part of her acting journey, it's also such an impacting song, which in the moment was shared with her husband, family, and friends. If you'd like to visit their past work, you can always watch or rewatch You're Beautiful. Song Joon Ki and Lee Kwang Soo these two have a pretty famous bromance of friendship that fans just can't seem to get enough of, and both have a popular fan base. While there might be tons of selfies promoting their bond of friendship, Song Joon Ki and Lee Kwang Soo have even had some viral moments of recognition that caught the interest of fans. For example, he once wrote a message on a rock, and it went viral. They met on a collaboration of the hit reality show, Running Man. Did you know that they're also the same Korean age? As individuals, as opposed to just characters that they portrayed, they make a pretty unique duo. But together, they certainly complement each other as good friends. Song Joon Ki is known for his stellar work in Descendants of the Sun and Vincenzo, not to mention his latest drama, Reborn Rich. Lee Kwang Soo had a guest role in DOTS, but he's known for his work in The Sound of Your Heart, also the killer shopping list. 
Lee Jung Suk and Kim Woo Bin. This is possibly one of the best bud romances which has lifted fans' hearts. To know that these sought after wildly popular actors are extraordinarily close. They originally starred together in the hit K drama School 2013. The story depicted former best friends who, due to circumstances, were no longer close. As viewers follow along to see if they can repair their broken bond, both actors went on to star in other successful dramas like Lee Jung Suk in W2 Worlds. Were you aware when Wu Bin was diagnosed with cancer, his bestie was there in support of him? As he made it through his recovery, fans were happy to see him back on the screen in Our Blues. But Kim Wu Bin might be most famously known for his role in The Heirs. Ayu and Yuna, with a heart-touching bond of friendship, Ayu and Yuna have stuck together for years, even having lived in the very same apartment building. Going way back to 2010, where they first met on the variety show called Heroes, their friendship carried forward, and these two even traveled abroad together, visiting Europe. Multiple sweet gestures and gift exchanges were shared openly between these two. Their dedication and thoughtfulness even touched fans' hearts, who admired the strong bond that these ladies share. Ayu is a famous idol and also known for her acting abilities. She played Heisu in Moon Lover's Scarlet Heart Rayo. Yuna has often played a sweet and charming leading lady, like in My Secret Hotel. We also loved her in Goblin as the bright and cheerful Sunny. Park Sojun and Chewa Shik these two could appear to be inseparable buds. They have shared many photo op moments together. Even if it's just selfies, they starred together way back in 2012 in the Korean sitcom known as Shut Up Family. They also speak very fondly and very kindly of each other. Park So Jun even had a small cameo role in the Academy Award winning film Parasite as a friend of Che Woo Shik's character thus having them share some more screen time together. Their kind gestures for each other are evident, and their friendship can be seen through posts and images shared. Fans adore both, and we hope to see them on the screen together again soon. For now, individually, you'll enjoy Park Seo Joon in Fight For My Way, Ida One Class, and What's Wrong With Secretary Kim. Did you know, Che Woo Shik had a guest role in Fight For My Way, but you'll also see him in Our Beloved Summer, The Boy Next Door, and Hoko's Love. KMDLers, Park Bo Gum, and BTS's V. These close buds have shown their admiration and respect for each other in more ways than one. Fans love seeing them together and cherish their connection. It seems they've been friends for quite a while. Even with V showing support visiting Bo Gum during his military service, they've also been on trips and various outings together. Probably one of the most notable ones was the 2022 Paris Fashion Show. Alongside Blackpink's Lisa, their presence created a huge stir and fan frenzy, with tons of paparazzi snapping photos at every turn. Several of their moments have been shared across the internet. V of BTS doesn't really need an introduction, and Park Bo Gum's reputation speaks for itself. You might remember his charming role in Love in the Moonlight. Gong Yoo and Lee Dong Wook Wow, both of these guys are pretty famous respectively. Hallyu stars with masses of fans. But when they both starred together in a drama, there was a huge reaction from fans, swooning over their bromance as seen on screen. And then IRL. It was for the drama Goblin, The Lonely and Great God. Gong Yoo and Lee Dong Wook's playful chemistry as an immortal and grim reaper gave fans of the stars an epic storyline and an equally epic bromance. The two characters may have had some initial dislike for each other, but then later, respect and understanding. Through this drama production, the two stars became friends in real life and continued to support each other after filming wrapped. Their positivity for each other could be seen on Lee Dong Wook's first talk show, where Gong Yoo appeared in support as a guest. Do you like this kind of content? If so, please hit the like and subscribe button for more great K-drama lists. Alright, we've got for you some other celebs spotted out and spending time together. Kim go -un and Jung Ryo Won had fun at Coachella in 2019 in support of Jenny of Blackpink. Lee Sun Kyung and Kim go -un also have shared some fun moments together. Can you think of any other celeb besties? If so, let us know in the comment section down below. Thanks for watching, MDLers.